guys, it's Adara. Hey, it's Ovi. And this is my cousin from Texas. She's here on her spring break to visit for, I guess, the week or a few days. And I decided to ask her if she wanted to do a Get Ready With Me video because I'm actually filming at the Ipsy Studios here in LA and it's my first time and I was just like, I wanted to show her something to do because I'm not that interesting anyway. So I was like- She has a lovely life, you guys. She <laughs> lives in LA. And we're just gonna like chit chat and have fun and mm -hmm. you know, you get to know us a little better. I like to bring my family in, especially when I have such really cute family members. So why not? I mean, they get it from me. So. <laughs> <laughs> Look at dimples. If I had those, Ugh. you'd be snatching everybody. No. Snitch, anyway. Snitch. Stop. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, yeah. So, subscribe. Watch this video. Let us know what you think. And we will talk to you guys later. Bye. Yeah. All right. So, we're just going to start our makeup and talk while we get ready. It's so much, it's like different not doing it like whenever you do your makeup, not in your like usual setup. Yeah. Like, Definitely not used to this. Yeah. And I gotta make sure I'm in this camera. Like. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you do first? Like, I always do eyebrows first because yeah, my too. eyebrows are so bushy right now. So I have to like do use like a lot of concealer. All right, so let's do some questions. All right, how did we, how and when did we first meet? Our cousins. I know we're cousins, but we didn't meet like right away. Yeah. Did we meet first in Nigeria or did when you guys came to the house in Texas first? Yo, I can't even remember. It has to be Texas. I think it's when you first came to Texas. No. Cause that was when we were we were like at Yeah, least, like, but you remember y'all used to tell me them stories about everybody else and I was just like, was I born? But we used to like not like them growing up. Cause they're just there's okay, so like I said, there's five of them. <laughs> and it's not like that that's the problem, but they used to rag on each other so much, but like if one of us tried to say anything or try to get on them, they would like attack. Like it was like a pack of them that would attack all of you or like whatever. And I'm just like, yo, chill. Like it's not even that serious. <laughs> no, but you know like how when you use like family stick, like when you got your family, you got your family. Yeah. Like we barely I guess at that point, like we barely knew them. So yeah. it was almost like Oh, you coming for fam? <laughs> yeah. So it was like, I remember we would try to make jokes or whatever, and yeah. it would just be like a thing. Like it would be end up being like, not like a fight or whatever. Probably an argument. Yeah, it would be like yeah. an argument, and they'd be like, they kind of gang up on you. What's a favorite memory that we have for each other? Favorite memory? Um, I mean, I love our Thanksgiving. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Our Thanksgiving. <laughs> our because Thanksgiving are so lovely. At the end of the day, like, we're all very busy. We're all kind of, like, spread out in age little, like, and so, you know, she's in school. I, you know, we just kind of move out here. But, like, I feel like Thanksgiving is, like, we all come together. And we, we all, all try to make sure we're there. Yeah, we all make sure. And then it's, like, we all act like crazy-ass fool. Because play games. Play games, play taboo, which gets... It, we don't too serious too yeah because we're already serious. like we're everybody. already competitive and then you put like a whole bunch of us there and yeah. it's just crazy and dukas and then you have like my mom's side of the family too it's like crazy but yeah those are like my, i love thanksgiving like i could like honestly, i wouldn't trade that holiday for yeah like I, i'm not like christmas is cool and all but like I prefer Thanksgiving because, like, we're always together, yeah. you know, like, a whole bunch of food. And a bunch of love to, yeah. go, you know, go around the family. All right. Describe each other in one word. Describe Odera. Yeah, you describe me and I'll describe you. Fashionista. <laughs> That's the same thing about you. <laughs> <laughs> because the first time I met you, you was all, like, you still are, but, like, you were all about fashion, this, that. Mm -hmm. And then everybody was like, if you need any fashion advice... Go to Adara. But this is the and but you're also very fashionable. Like it's like you're well almost like the same. Yeah. But like we also we still have different like ways of dressing and different yeah. styles and but it's like we we have the same tendencies. Yeah. And it's funny too, like I said, it's it, I don't know if it's a family thing, because like your sister, my sister, like Nikki, like whatever, like we're yeah, all, we're all like, yeah. It's like very it's so important. weird. Yeah. Well all of our families like just into almost the same thing. Yeah. I mean, it's like it's funny because I always say like I want to do like a video with all of us because it's like we all have different looks, but it's like all works for us. Like, all right. what's your favorite makeup brand? Do I even have one? There's so many. Are you? Oh, I'm like chewing gum. I just realized that. I'm gonna spit that out. I had to like if you had to put like a gun to my head, <laughs> like a literally whole gun. a whole gun, like not even have, like. <laughs> but I would probably say um, I really, really like. Anastasia Beverly Hills. 
because I feel like I could probably, not like a full face because I don't have like foundations and stuff, but I can probably use like a majority of their products on my face at one time. You know time. what? I found my answer. NYX. For all our oh, yeah. women that love to, you know, shop Bargain and on a budget. Yeah. And the thing with NYX too, and I love NYX, but because they're- It's on the come up. Yeah, it is on the, on the come up. definitely on the come up. And they, they, um, they have really good products. It's like the same company that makes like MAC and stuff. I heard. Too. Definitely. So honestly- I was about to try leader when I do my color correcting. What's oh. something that annoys you about the other person? Like what? Like, like what? Person? Yeah. Like no. Like annoys you about me and what I. And... I don't. You don't really annoy me. Yeah, honestly. I'm pretty sure I know you. <laughs> not really. Again, like we all have our own lives, but like, so whenever we do see each other, it's like really hard to like annoy each other because it's not like we see each other all, all the, the time. time. If you can go anywhere <laughs> in the world, thanks for hitting me. <laughs> if you can go anywhere in the world together, where would it be? I want to go to Jamaica. If y'all talking about it? I want to go anywhere. Like I am. A, I honestly want to be a world traveler. I want to go too. That's anywhere, why I'm anywhere. Global. Yeah, I don't really like being in like just being in one place for too long. I love to travel. So far, I've been to um, like Nigeria, Dubai, um, Europe. So I would go anywhere. Like, just tell me where and I'm going. Let's um, pray that this makeup comes out. I know. Why? Why just look crazy? It's our first time. <laughs> it's our first time filming make, here, make and then, sure so this comes out really good. They're gonna be like, y'all. What are y'all doing? <laughs> this is my BB cream, guys. It's from Maybelline. Okay, yeah. Wait. I don't know if y'all got it. Yeah. But that's my BB cream. It's by Maybelline. I use deep sheer tint. It's beautiful for my skin. It's so bare. Who was the first one? Was it Nikki? That Somebody. It was you. No, I don't use BB cream. No, you remember when we went to um, Chicago? We went. I didn't go to Chicago. Yeah, okay, Chicago. hold on, hold on. <laughs> there was a trip that we went on with the family. And we were in a hotel. Well, we was young. Don't worry. Oh, no, no, no. And you were using tinted moisturizer. I was, but I think it was from MAC or something. A long time. Okay, yeah, a long time like, ago. I remember, too, because yes. I remember everybody got mad at you because you wouldn't get out of the room. <laughs> we were getting dressed, and everybody was like, "Oh, be hurry up!" Oh, really? Yeah. No one told me that until today. Maybe okay. It was Houston. It was but yeah, but I, 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 at one point, I have used tinted. I forgot. Okay, that. so yes, you did. And then um, my sister was like, "Why don't you try tinted moisturizer, y'all?" Because my skin is so weird. I think my complexion doesn't have like a specific tone, so it's so hard for me to like find that color. And it's like, yeah, I can mix or whatever, but that's more <laughs> money to y'all. Yeah, I've never found a BB cream though. That's why I don't really use it. I look like a crazy person, but um, that's why I don't really use it because I can never find it. Well, I have to mix it, or they're never like dark enough for me. But, okay, so who takes it ready? Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? I guess we're, about to, we're about to find out now. Yeah, <laughs> y'all just <laughs> like, y'all basically just saw how she's on the next level. I am still out here blending. To see, I actually don't know. It depends, honestly. It take I can take really little time to get ready, but it like if I'm not doing that much, so it's not a problem. But if I'm taking, if I'm doing a lot, then like yeah, it takes me a little longer. So it depends on like what we're doing. Um, what's your favorite song? I like Heaven at the moment or at like in life. Where, 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 where? <laughs> really? That's where, 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 where? Or, um. Formation. Need, need me because y'all need me. Whatever. <laughs> You're so dumb. Okay, so let's do a different question. Okay, this is funny. So if a house was burning down and your entire family was sure to be okay, what would you save and why? If all my family was okay? Yeah. Shoot, if my family wasn't okay, <laughs> they better be okay. That's all I know. You're all grown. <laughs> you there should be no reason that you can't get up by yourself. I would be like, what is wrong with you? Yo, did you not hear the fire alarm? I would be I like, get throw up. Some, throw some shoes at somebody. I, mean, I ain't got no dogs, so don't expect me to Oh, yeah. That. Well, if I, Oh, you do. I do, but he's in family, so he's safe. He yeah. would just, he would that run dog, out with everybody. That dog ain't a part of this family. He, <laughs> you better accept him. That's my baby. I don't know what I would say. I guess yeah, makeup. 
But that's a lot of shoe. I have so much makeup. It would yeah. be. I would, I would die more. just trying to get like it out of the house. Yeah, I'm just. I was just kidding about the makeup guys. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, why would you save your makeup? Oh my god, oh she my would god. save her makeup. But, uh, over a dog. <laughs> <laughs> Who are some of your fashion and well, yeah, fashion icons? Um, honestly, for fashion, what do I like? Okay, this is finally blended in. I'll probably end up doing some more blending. I like um, Kim Kardashian. Really? For her fashion. I mean, even There's though it's not stuff. hers anymore. Yeah. It's pretty much Kanye. It's Kanye. I like, I'm, I'm, I, I like, like Kanye. Kanye. The thing is, like, I don't like to do the most when it mm-hmm. comes to a lot of clothes. And I can, like, I like to make simples look, like, really, really nice. Yeah. So, like, she is the queen of basics, I yeah. would say. I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm basic, but I was, I'm saying, like, she's the queen of putting something simple together mm-hmm. and making it pop. Okay. So, why am I forgetting my, my makeup routine? Yeah, no, so I'm like, that's what I was thinking too. I was like, what do I do next? But I'm about to do some eyeshadow. Um, I just have like a lot. I think it depends on my mood. Like, my style can change depending that's, on that's my the, mood. That's the right answer. Yeah. Let's see, if I had to choose a Kardashian's sister, I'm, I like Chloe's style, like right now with her like weight loss and everything. I think mm-hmm. she's been really doing it. She's been killing it on that front. Honestly? Kendall got me too. Yeah, oh no, I like hers. Kendall, come on, girl. Yeah. She's not too far from my age. <laughs> we can be friends. Yeah, we can be friends. <laughs> I think I'm going to do a really simple eyeshadow. Yeah, I'm going to do anything like super crazy. Yeah, like, I don't know what I'm going to do today. I know, I should have been more prepared. So, we're, I'm trying, well, I guess a lot of people are trying to get Obi to get a YouTube channel because, like I said, Obi's like so popular and no, everybody loves her. No. And <laughs> so she, so we've been trying to convince her. So y'all should put it in the comments that she should have a makeup channel because everybody wants to know how to do makeup like you. And it's funny because I mean, like we've been doing our makeup together, and we kind of have like the same steps, but not like you know. I'm makeup. contouring now, you guys. I'm gonna do that after. I like what? doing my foundation. How do you do that? No, well, because I like doing my foundation, and then I do my eyeshadow, and then I go back, and I'll either... I'm not going to re-highlight, though, because I just did that whole thing. But if I was, I would have, like, re-highlighted. I mean, mm-hmm. highlighted, then done my contour. But usually, like, I put my foundation first, and then I do my eyes, and then go back. And then... I don't know why. It's just a weird thing. What is your favorite movie? Yo, I'm going to sound so cliche, but Love and Basketball. Was your favorite? I watched it again and I realized how much I love it. <laughs> like, you know, the first time we watched it, we was kids. We didn't understand yeah. Do you it. know, I always, every time, is it Maxwell who sang that song? The Whenever they're in the bedroom, when they're like, you know, getting it on for the first time? I think so. Every time I hear that song in the radio, my mind goes straight back to that, that scene. I'm yeah. in basketball. And I'm always thinking about her, how she's like. <laughs> that was so cute. I also like, um... Is it think like a man, act like a man? Okay. The first one is fine. The second, the second one, one was, was the, outlandish. It's hard for me to choose favorite movies because I always have like a lot that I like. Like recently, I'm trying to think what's a movie. I, and I haven't really watched a movie not recently. Oh, I lied, you guys. I love Transformers. I'm like a fa- I might act, Let me be weird. I don't care. I love Transformers. Like that's my movie. All of them. Number one, number two. <laughs> and even if, even if like the last I one, love Shia LaBeouf, so that's why I really love that movie. And Megan Fox, listen, that She's is my big. I like uh, what's that woman's name again? That's married to that man that just won an Oscars, that has not won it all his life. What's his name again? Leo. Leo's not married. No, 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 not Leo. Oh my God, I'm talking about Brad Pitt. My bad. I was about to be my like bad, Leo has not won. Uh, Angelina. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking about Angelina. But Leo, I love Leo too, guys. Okay, let I'm me t- happy for that. Honestly, let me tell you something about the whole like Oscar thing. I kind of wanted him not to win because Why? they were predicting he was gonna win. Like as soon as he got, you know, before even he got nominated, they were like, "Oh, that's this is gonna be his Oscar." So it got to a point that it was just like so predictable. I kind of wanted him not to win just to be like a surprise. Nah, bro. He deserved it. <laughs> no, he did. I'm not saying not, he did it. Yeah. I just, but it was just. It would have been like, oh, what? Like that would have been really. You know what shocking. I was hoping? It would have been like, you know, like whenever they do, um, 
Like those Martin. like those uh, TV shows or whatever, they always like you know it's like a movie and they always joke about how like somebody thinks they're about to win, so they start to stand up and then they call somebody else's name. I kind of wanted that to happen. Like the Steve, <laughs> the Steve Harvey yeah. incident. Basically, that would have been hilarious. Mm. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm so I'm happy he won, but it would have just been a little fun and a little bit of controversy. Like I wanted to see what would happen. Damn. Did you watch the show, the Oscars? Um, I watched that part. <laughs> <laughs> Did you watch uh, Chris Rock's um, monologue? No. When he was, when he went, well, he didn't really go I in on I think I had Jada. finals that time, to uh, be honest. He didn't really go in on Jada, but, you know, people, like, make it a bigger deal. Hey, Leo yeah. might as well be black sometimes. <laughs> he can fit in. Like, he's that Justin Timberlake to me. Yeah. Justin Justin Timberlake got, well, he's been in for a he's while. He's definitely he got. Have you seen that? Game. Did you see that thing on Facebook talking about, like, white people who he'd be invited to, like, black barbecue, barbecue or whatever? Or black cookout, it's hilarious. No, I didn't see it. It was so funny. It he was, says on what? It's like all the, they were like naming white people who would be invited to, to like a cookout, like you know, a barbecue or whatever for black <laughs> families. And so Justin Timberlake was on there, and they were like, <laughs> and one person was like, Trump is invited only so we can knock him out. <laughs> yeah, you can come. You can come, dude. <laughs> so I was like, shout okay. out to Texas Tech for the garbage cans with the Trump ballots. Oh yeah, I saw yes. the picture on that. Gonna be crazy. Are you registered to vote? Yes, I am. I'm not. I need to register. I'm, I mean, I'm registered in Texas, but I'm not registered here yet. Mm-hmm. So I need to like um, register here because I need to make sure I do my part. Do you want to live in that area? I would. What girl? I would only girl, because. Wow. Look, you can make a lot of money in Nigeria. You could. There's so many opportunities out there, and you know, I feel like I wouldn't be a full time. I wouldn't live there full time. I'd probably live there for like a few months out of the year, like three to four or five months out of the year. But people told me to do it. Nothing too crazy, super basic. I'm gonna do that look that y'all keep asking about on my Instagram. Do this look. It was a video. I made a video. I was at this fashion show. I was modeling for this fashion show and I did um, a simple makeup look but everybody seemed to like it. Is there more questions? Um, yeah, we went on a tangent. Um, what's your favorite? Did I ask you what's your favorite TV show? No. What's your favorite TV show? Walking Dead is mine. Really? Right now because it's still, I mean, Walking Dead, I'm waiting for Game of Thrones to come on. I love Scandal. I love it's basically anything on TGIT. I like Breaking Bad. I've never watched Breaking Bad. Because I got into it, like, I tried. I, like, I looked it up on Netflix, and I was going to watch it. But that first episode, like, the 10 minutes, I was, I was like, nah. I you know can't. what makes me mad? Everybody talks about that first episode, and I'm like, can you get past it? That's it's so reason, hard. That's the reason why y'all don't like it. I know. So I get like, past the get first episode. episode. So what I was, like, thinking, maybe I'll just skip the first, because everybody's like, you need to get to, like, episode number three. Or you something. can't boost like that and skip <laughs> You guys, I'm super depressed, and I need somebody to figure out how I can find this. This is, like, the, my favorite bronzer of all time. It was probably the only one I've really used, but it's a drugstore. It's from CoverGirl um, Queen Collection, and it's Ebony Bronze. I have been, every time I go to a Target or a CVS or anything like that, I try to find, like, look for it, and I can never see it anywhere. And I'm just like, what am I going to do? And for some reason, I don't want to order it online, though. Like, I get weird about certain things. Like, I don't, i rather shop online for most, like, clothes and stuff, but when I get to, like, makeup, Sometimes I hate ordering it online. No, that. What's your favorite Disney movie? Um, I love, even though it's not um one of the traditional ones, I'm loving this Frosted. Frosted or Frozen? Frosted. <laughs> it's Frosted. <laughs> We're gonna change the name. It's Frosted. That's that's part two. Y'all didn't know about. Part two. <laughs> she got a she got advanced screening to part two. It's another movie. Oh. I think it's called Inside Out. Oh my gosh! They talk did you watch this? it? No. It won an award, yeah, and I will tell you. Teach all your kids, if y'all have kids out there, any young women with kids, any young men, if y'all watching this video, Inside Out is a great movie for your child to understand about personality traits and like family and friendships. Like the way they made that movie. <laughs> it makes you it seem so deep. No, because it was. If you watch the movie, like the way they operate, it was like, it was amazing. And it's a kid movie. And I'm over here like, who thought this deep? I was watching the movie and I was like, the way they put this together is beautiful. Cause it's like, they had an island of personalities and it was basically showing you like the different stages of life and what you go through mm-hmm. is what creates these personalities. Cause a lot of people are like, I don't understand this person or I don't understand this guy or I don't understand this girl. 
it's what they go through in their life that makes them who they are. You can't judge them off of what you know now because that's not who they are. You know, I mean, maybe that's who they are, but they've gone through some stuff to get there. Mm -hmm. So it's like, I'm telling you, that movie, ooh, it shows you the good and the bad. It's really good. I might watch it. Oh, right. you're not putting on your eyelashes? No, I'm about to. I just put mascara on too. What? Yo. <laughs> Learning new yeah, things. Yeah, because every... I was like, I don't know. That's not how I do it. But that, yeah, that's Because I don't like putting mascara on my lashes because I want to reuse them. I love them on my lashes. I just wash them. You wash them? Mm hmm. Why? Like soap. Really? Your lashes? Yep. And it doesn't mess them up? Mm hmm. Never tried that. I find ways, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I see. you gonna last. <laughs> if I bought you, you gonna last. So it isn't like mess up with the lash, like after washing it? Um, it just depends on how you dry it. If you dry it in a way that it's like it's gonna mess up the lash, yeah, for sure. It's gonna come out looking crooked. But if you like dry it the way that it was like it came out, mm -hmm. it would look nice. The hardest part in any Mac makeup thing for me is trying to decide what lip color to do. And I always want to just go to my tried and true dark purple. But sometimes you gotta mix it up. You guys, I like Amrezy. How many of y'all like Amrezy? Like the majority of people love Amrezy. Listen, like that is my girl. I'll be watching her Snapchats. Just her everyday life. I just like it. She's just... she. I like that she's real. She like she doesn't like need to. She doesn't feel like she needs to act a certain way. Mm -hmm. She doesn't really care when people hate on her. I don't understand why people hate on people sometimes. I'm like, it's her life. Like, why are you jealous? Like, you just let her do her. Who do I vibe with musically? J Cole, I like Kendrick, Kendrick Lamar, yeah. Travis Scott. I like you, Kanye, for this new album. You like it? I have I have not heard anything from his new album. Mm -hmm. well, I like Big Sean. Yeah, I like Big Sean too. Um, I know I'm missing somebody because I know when I watch this video, I'm gonna be like, "Why didn't I say?" I know, but it's whatever. At the end of the day, I rock with all of them. The undergrounds too. I don't see. I'm, I'm not I in, really in the underground. I know you want this for life. Taking pictures with all my eyes. Who is that? I, <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't know any of these people. I can't have. I'm such no an old lady life. now. I just want you for the night. Who is this? <laughs> Did you hear like Wendy Williams had said something like Rihanna is never going to be like a legend? Yeah. And I was like thinking about it. I was like, I wonder if she really is because her music is good for now. <laughs> the only reason why I think she said that is because, yes, I understand that Beyonce it, like gives everybody like that woman empowerment mm -hmm. type of vibe, but y'all have to understand that that edgy, um, gothic, but, but sexy, classy mm -hmm. look that Rihanna brought is through, you know what I'm saying? But That's new. Do you think her music is going to be something like, you know how like now if we hear like, you know, some of the, our, the old school jams, we'd be getting like, we'd be like going crazy or something like that. Mm -hmm. And it's like, cause we remember that from back in the day and it like makes us feel good. Like you see her music being like that? Um, Not really because she's not empowering. empowering. Well, it's not necessarily empowering, but you know, like, okay, like, Something like Montel Jordan. Is it Montel Jordan who does like this is how we're doing it? Yeah. But like, you know, you be out and you may be like chilling, but you hear that song, you'd be like, oh, like, so there's a lot of people. I don't know if I'm going to, if, you know, there's going to be like people going to be like, oh, yeah, that's my song from yeah. back in the day. Like, I don't know who, may I can see Beyonce doing it. And I came out a little later. Yeah. So she still has time. Yeah. Back to my lips. So I just did Night Moth. Now I'm going to go with Mars from Colored Rain. I'm surprised I woke up this morning. Girl, that's dedication. <laughs> I mean, I have to be up anyway. To get me, uh, yeah, you have to. To get me out of uh, up and out of bed. And then, lastly, I'm gonna use not that one. Pure Hollywood by Anastasia. I should have put this on Periscope. I wonder if y'all would have watched it. Listen, if I do this, y'all gotta let me know. If you want me to make videos. Periscope, any of those. Let me know. I'm done. You done? Yeah. So technically, back to that question, I get ready first. <laughs> or you take longer. What is this ColourPop limbo, guys? 
I have not tried anything from ColourPop yet, and I need to because I hear so much stuff about it. Mm-hmm. It's really nice. But it kind of looks like Salem. Yep, and that's why I got it because <laughs> I like Salem. Okay, guys, so that's basically it. This is our get ready. This is what we look like. Yes. Do we look like people always say like I look more like you guys? She than, do, you do. Than, than I look like my There's, sister. Yes, you do. Like our side of the family, like the Nadukas, like from the dad's side. It's like we have like slimmer, like something about our noses and then our like. I mean, this is contour home. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Again, put in your comments if Obi should start her own channel. Um, and let us know what you guys think of this and our look. And if there's any other questions we have. Um, this is probably going to be going up by the time you're gone. But obviously, she'll get the message. And um, yeah, go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Like, um this video and leave a comment and I will also be putting our Instagram pages and stuff, Snapchat names, all that stuff. So if you want to follow us, you guys follow <laughs> this is, this is how she does all the time. Like everything that has, Listen. anything you can see yourself in, she treats as a mirror. So, <laughs> hey, thanks for coming and doing this video with me. And thanks for, uh, this is my first video at Ipsy. So hopefully I have some cool ones coming up next. So mm -hmm. thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Bye. Bye. Um. I look tired. This is why people say, don't wear makeup. I look <laughs> tired when I don't have makeup on. So, or don't, just don't tie it too tight. Like, kind of like leave it like. Yeah, fingers. I was going to get the, like, the tip tip. Mm hmm. That's what she said. Wow. <laughs> You're so, I'm over here taking pictures. I'm trying to get it for the snack. <laughs>